the students of Government Law College, Ernakulam, Kerala, who are pursuing the BALLB integrated course, have now been told that the course was not recognized by the Bar Council of India. This means that they will not be eligible to get enrolled as advocates even if they complete the course successfully. 400 students who presently are enrolled in this course are staring at uncertain future because of this entanglement. Two decades after the city of Madras became Chennai and Bombay became Mumbai, the high courts in both the cities will finally adopt the names by an act of parliament during the upcoming monsoon session. The law ministry has prepared a cabinet note on a bill changing the names of the high courts. According to senior ministry sources, not only state governments but also the high courts have to concur with the same name changes as it involves technical issues regarding statute books and the fact that the courts, especially the three presidency courts of Madras, Bombay and Calcutta were established under the Indian High Court Act of 1861. A case was registered in Kanpur and Lucknow courts today against Bollywood actor Salman Khan for his recent statement that he felt like a raped woman while shooting for his forthcoming flick, Sultan. Social activist Rafat Jamal in a petition filed before the Chief Judicial Magistrate in Lucknow has asked for legal action against the actor for the statement which showed disrespect to rape victims and also revived the ugly memories of such heinous crimes. Manoj Kumar Dikshit, a lawyer, has filed a petition in the additional Chief Metropolitan Magistrate's third court in Kanpur seeking action against the actor. Sharia court's bias towards wealthy Muslim men during the Ottoman Empire may have contributed to its downfall according to a major study of nearly 200 years of case records. An American economist Timur Kuran looked at rulings handed out between 1602 and 1799 and noticed the judge's efforts to help people considered worthy of support had a significant unintended consequence. In Ottoman Istanbul court, biases resulted in high interest rates for the rich and privileged. These days, the very factors that once worked against the rich may be harming the poor, Quran said. A Lahore High Court Division Section 10 of Chapter 10 in Sub Rules. Parents filed these petitions against the Education Board for denying their children registration for 9th class for being younger than the age prescribed under Rule 1A of Chapter 19 of the Board Calendar. Representing one of the petitioners, advocate Shiraz Zaka argued that there was no provision in the Punjab Free and Compulsory Education Act 2014 that imposed such conditions. He said it was discriminatory that in order to appear in Class 9 exams, a student had to be 12 years of age and the impugned policy was a violation of Article 25A of the Pakistan Constitution. The court adjourned hearing till the second week of September for final arguments. Six members of outlawed lashkar e jangvi or LEJ terror group were indicted by a Pakistani anti-terrorism court in 2009. Sri Lankan cricket team attack case. Obaidullah, Javed Anwar, Ibrahim Khalil, Abdul Wahab, Zubair and Adnan Arshad pleaded not guilty. The court summoned prosecution witnesses on June 20th while adjourning the hearing. In March 2009, the bus carrying the Sri Lankan cricket team was attacked by the Taliban and LEJ militants with sophisticated weapons and grenades at Liberty Chowk near Kaddafi Stadium, Lahore.